So today we're gonna make a very special dish, the Branzino aqua pazza, the sea bass with aqua pazza sauce. So aqua pazza in Italian means crazy water. So let's do some crazy water first. To make this recipe, you will need a large pan, and this pan we don't have a cover, so we will make a cover with aluminium foil, which is very easy to make. You need scissors to open the bag, a spatula to take the fish, and one spoon. Okay, so first you have to put the extra virgin olive oil into the pot. Then when the pot is slightly warm, so we don't want it to be too hot, we want it to be just slightly warm. We put the red onions inside. Whole cloves of garlic, so we don't want it to be sliced, we want it to have the whole cloth inside. Sliced cherry tomato. and whole peppercorn. So we just want the, fry, the oil to take the fragrance of the garlic and the tomato. Then to start the crazy water, we will use some white wine. And some homemade fish stock. So what we are doing is we are doing a bath where we're going to steam the fish inside. So we just want to bring this to the boil and to make sure that all the flavor will go inside. So once the crazy water reaches to a boil, we want to add a little bit of acidity with some lemon juice. So then you can put it to your liking as well. If you want it quite on the bitter side, you can put the whole bag. If you want it slightly bitter, just put half of the bag in. So when we have the crazy water ready, we're going to dip the fish inside. So for the fish, we have a beautiful 600 gram sea bass that we will bake inside and then add on top some slice of lemon. So once you have the fish inside the crazy water, you can just cover the pot with aluminium foil so the fish will be steam inside. And fish, we see you in 20 minutes. So 25, 20 minutes later, the fish is cooked. So we have the beautiful Branzino aqua pazza. Only left is to put it on the plate. So you have to take it very gently. So I, I use the tongue to grab the tail and then the spatula to grab the body. Put it on the plate. Then to nourish it, I will use the crazy water and I will put it on top of the fish. Make sure you use, you put all the vegetables because this is all the, where the flavor is. The last touch will be some fresh parsley that you can put display on top of the fish. And then, à table! Bon appétit, bien sûr!